Hello. Uh, so here I will try to show how to possibly um, run the game as right now there is an issue with the new latest latest version of the launcher so I believe the uh, issue that pretty much everyone is facing is this one so I, oh, I have both the launcher versions here this is the old one which was working and this is the new one which has the error so I have both the launcher.exe like outside like it is always there in the outside but for both of them it's the different I mean the executables like this uh, like this executable will uh, this this launcher will refer to this folder and this one will refer to this so for reference like for verification I will show you shawan shawan sum zero I mean the wrong folder Mm. Ah. Shawn zero launcher. Yep. So this is the Shawn hash of this launcher, and then we we'll go to one dot four. Yep. So this one is the old launcher from the old launcher folder, and from the new one. One. Yeah, this one. This is the new launcher from the new version. Fine. Launch. Ah. Yeah. If you can see. So this is from the new and this is for from the old one. So I have set up my launcher on Steam. And I, I just added it as a non steam game and compatibility 9.927 Proton GE. Not the latest one, like every, everyone is rec recommending to try TKG Proton Experimental, saying that it, it has fixed some of the issues, like it has fixed, uh, like you can play the game on it, or like someone was mentioning, like you can try it on Proton 7 or like Proton 5. Uh, but somehow I'm still able to do it on this version as well, 9.27. So first we will try with the latest launcher and replicate the issue that everyone is facing. And this is the first one, one underscore launcher.exe. Now I launch it. Oh, excuse my name. <laughs> yeah. So it just like uh, closes itself, right? Like pretty much everyone has this issue. Like when you, when you launch the game or like launch it, the launcher. It will just close. It will pop up here, like in the, my, my bad, it's not visible properly. But we, uh, the icon will appear here and then close. <coughs> so this is the, this is the case with the new one. So let's switch to the old one. So in case of old one, I guess it is very much, uh, pretty, I guess everyone can, uh, how would I say like predict, we'll ask for the update. Yeah, we'll ask for the update. And if you go for the update, then you will just get to the latest version and it will have the same issue of closing. It will just shut down itself. So what you have to do is first you close it. Then first, uh, it, it's a bit tricky, but what you have to do is you have to play with the network. You have to close, you have to turn down your network and then launch the launcher. Or like when you launch the launcher, you have to be ready and just disconnect. It appears here. Yeah. I disconnected from the network now. Yeah. Now what you do is you have to just be really fast or like do all sort of um, parkour or something. I don't know what to call it. Hit start game and then connect. <clears throat> the game will launch.
let's see if, if it reaches till the yeah i let, let's see if it reaches till the login page then it's fine yeah yeah it's fine yeah we're good to go so if you click yeah i guess you can go ahead from here you can actually play the game but the issue is i'm not going to sh uh Maybe I can. <laughs> oh no, it is visible. Please don't ban me. I just want to play the game. Hmm. It's working perfectly fine. No performance dips or anything. Stable 60. Yeah. So that's how you run it. The only problem you might probably face is uh, when you uh, try to launch the game and also, uh, you know, uh, when you close the game. Because after that, you have to start the launcher again. Like, what I'm facing right now, like, Oh, and one more issue, I for some reason, whenever I try to close Genshin, it doesn't close as gracefully, it just crashes or like, just goes into an end endless loop or something. So what I have been doing is like, uh, P-Kill Genshin, sadly. And it will return the launcher, but it will be very buggy. Yeah, you will get back to this. So you have to start the whole process again. St stop. Now let's try for Zenless. Um, as it, as soon as it appears, I disconnected from network. Yeah, now click on Zenless. I right, click on Start Game and then Wired Connection. So it works. I thought it crashed. How the noise in Potter? Yep, it is working fine. Ah, it's a bit laggy. <laughs> Ooh, okay. Uh, rendering one point two, was it in one point two? Put it at one point eight. Yeah, no, it works smoothly. I hope the game is not too noisy. Ah, what is it? Hmm. So yeah, the game is working fine. And so this is uh how you play it again. Shin, play in Shin or in this on Linux right now because of the issues. Just close now. Ah, how do you exit? I forgot. Look at that. Yep, and we'll come back. So yeah 
give it a try if it works comment less if you have issues i will try to listen and see if i could do something yeah can i be safe